Oh man, I love spring break. What do you think about this, Louis? Yeah, I totally agree. Uh, excuse me, Big Brother Tonto. Oh, what is it, cameraman? You do realize it's not spring. Oh, really? Well, if it's not spring, then why am I on spring break? Well, uh, that's like, um, somebody else's fault. Somebody else? Yeah, uh, the college you go to. Wait, I'm in college? Apparently so. I, I didn't even know I was in college. What the heck is wrong with the society? Uh, could you please, like, just, I don't know, do something? What do you mean, do something? Well, since you got the camera, and I haven't done a Cracks My Egg episode in, like, a while. Uh, hey, everybody, uh, this is Big, Bro Big Brother Tonto here for another episode of Cracks My Egg. Um, today's episode is gonna be about, uh, college spring breaks, and why I find them to be so awkward. This might be a short one, I don't have much to talk about with this, but, uh, yeah, right now I am on spring break this week, in case you guys didn't know. Uh, that's why we're uploading, like, uh, a new video each, uh, weekday this week. So, uh, that's, uh, one reason why. And, uh, yeah, I just find it kind of weird that, like, you know, spring break in, in college is not even in spring. Well, at least where I go to, but, man, that's, like, so weird. I mean, it, you know... There are, like, other colleges out there that also, like, have spring break, like, earlier in the year than, like, wh where I am right now. Like, what the heck, college? Or colleges in general? Like, seriously, what happened to, like, having spring break right around Easter? Like, a lot of schools do it, like, anything before college. Uh, their spring break is close to Easter. Like, why can't ours be the same? Like, come on! I mean, it's in the spring... Of course, and it's right around Easter, and of course, Easter is a holiday widely celebrated um, in our country. So, um, yeah, and then of course, like, you know, if you're in college and, uh, you know, you're celebrating Easter with, like, your family, which, you know, in my opinion, at this point, Easter isn't really much of a important holiday anymore, in my opinion. I don't know, it just doesn't really feel the same as it once was when I was a kid, but... That's a topic for maybe another day. Hint, hint. Um, but anyways, um, man, I, I got off track. What was I talking about again? Crap, I forgot. Um, but yeah, just, just so you guys could get my point. Um, I find it weird that colleges have spring break, like not around spring. Uh, that's all you need to hear. Okay. Uh, by the way, um, I'm, I'm getting thirsty. Can you hand me that uh, Dr. Pepper over there? Uh, yeah, sure thing, Big Brother Tonto. Uh, here you go. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, can you keep it still? Come on. Keep it still, man. Is it not still? Well, we're on a couch for one thing. You mean I'm on a couch. And Louie's on a couch. And everybody else is probably on a couch watching this. They're probably on a chair. Shut up, man. Anyways. Okay, I'm gonna have you a taste of this. <laughs> Oh my god, what is this garbage? Diet, Dr. Pepper! What is wrong with you, man? I'm trying to make you lose weight, Big Brother Tonto. Well, okay, look. Okay, let me tell you one thing. Um, Diet Pop, from what I've heard, is um, equally, if not worse, than regular Pop. So, basically, you're basically um, trying to uh, kill me, basically. Not really. Uh, you kind of are. I mean, this stuff might be worse than Dr. Pepper. It might even be equally as bad as Dr. Pepper. But I love Dr. Pepper, man, so... But yeah, but this stuff tastes terrible. But it's good for you. It is not good for you. At least that's not from what I've heard. But, uh, yeah, I don't care if it's, like, regular Dr. Pepper, if it's Diet Dr. Pepper, if it's Dr. Pepper that was, like, living inside your butthole for, like, the past ten years. I don't care what kind of Dr. Pepper it is. Like, it's, like, equally, um, you know, just pop, you know? It, it, it just, like, has, you know, a, a lot of, like, you know... Let me, let me look at the freaking uh, nutrient effects on here. Um, it's got, it's got, like, sodium. That's, like, really the only thing on this that's, like, not zero. But, uh... Yeah, it just, like, regular pop, it has no source of, like, vitamin A, C, calcium, iron, col... Well, it doesn't have cholesterol, at least. I mean, that's a good thing. But still, um, it doesn't have any fiber... 
but yeah, so, okay, you know, this is kind of like a, you know, a two video thing, like, I'm just gonna, like, rename it, like, I don't know, like, college spring break slash, uh, pop, there you go, that's what, what we could call this episode, I mean, I know I already did an episode on Mountain Dew, but I might as well do an episode on just pop in general, but, uh, yeah, that's about it, get out of here, I'm gonna go on my somewhat spring break, if you don't mind me. Uh, okay then. Uh, finish up your Dr. Pepper. Uh, I'll take that stuff away from me. That stuff is nasty. Give me a regular one. You just said that stuff is equally as bad. I said it may be equally as bad or even worse. So, if it's like, if regular Dr. Pepper is better than, uh, this diet crap, then give me the regular stuff. Um, I guess I'll do that. Um, I'm, I'll just take this away. Yeah, you better take it away. I mean, if I see that thing back here one more time, I am gonna kill you. Alright, uh, where's my, where's my Dr. Pepper? Oh, thank you very much, it. Oh, God. Oh, you son of a gun, you son of a gun, you son of a- Yeah, fall down, I hate you! Oh, God, oh, God!